morning guys, welcome to today. Today is Easter Monday, it's a holiday in Canada. Uh, hopefully some places are open today, but it is also pouring rain. God is bringing up the grass with all this rain. Our little herd is super happy, happy. Super happy and relaxed. I see footprints, oh, rubies. Sophie said do not just give him his scant grain. Hold it back until he doesn't pin his ear, she told me. Girls are on their way down. Chino Bambino, some of you guys guess Bambi is what Gabby calls him. And you're right, she calls him Bambi. They're like, you're a little late. It's Easter Monday, it's a holiday, you guys. Uh-oh, Benny's like, give it to me. They all have their ears pinned. Whew. We try and come at different times each morning, not too late, but different. we stagger it so that they don't get used to being fed at the exact same time, but that's why Sophie hates that stall. No. Don't pin your ears. Put your ears forward. Hurry up so Sophie doesn't come. She'll make you wait for five hours. Remember how I was a little worried about putting them out on the grass when we first moved here? Literally, there's, there must be getting nothing because their poop hasn't changed a single solitary bit. I've been watching for it. Why are you out there in the rain, crazies? What the heck? Come on, you'll be cold. Wow, they look spooked or something. That's weird. They've never acted like that before. Yeah, I looked down this morning and they weren't in the arena and that's odd. Oh, she's cold. I'm gonna get a blanket for her. Something scared them in here. Just put their food down and see if they come. There we go. Oh, you'd be cold. How long you been out there? Oh, something spooked them. That's okay, what's spooking you? They got spooked out. I, I hate when that happens. So, uh, Gracie's a little cold. We're gonna dry her off, warm her up. Willow's good. Somebody mentioned Gracie has a, Willow has a big bald spot from her blanket. We were able to adjust her blanket and make it better. Her spot's growing back. It's all good. Oh, hello there, Miss Red Riding Hood. Guys! Got your blanket. Look at my blanket. You got your blanket. It Every, was shielding me. Everybody said don't worry about letting it rip. Oh, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> She's like, you did not put that in the vlog. So I only bought one for Gabby because Storm and Chino technically were the same size. And now that I'm thinking about it, I'm thinking like, what if they get wet and they get cold and we only have one, so I think I'm gonna order another one. What other color would you want, Gabby? Uh, the same color or you want? But then it'd be hard, you always have to look at sizes. Same. Same color? All right. I don't really have to look at sizes for all three matching blankets. Yeah, that's true. That's that's. That is one bad part about buying matching blankets. Yeah, we could write their names, I guess. Anyway, today I'm gonna try something completely different. I'm gonna tell the girls right now. All right, so today, because the weather's supposed to be a torrential rain pour and Ooh, cold, I'm windy. Well, we're putting in ponies in stalls and the boys in the girls' fields. Yeah, what do you think? I heard you. Yeah, do you think it would be a good idea? Uh, not enough room for them to fight. I know, except for they that. Yeah, they really don't, but we're gonna try it. So that's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna bring the, oh, Grace is just shivering. And she's spooked. So we're gonna bring the mares in, let them stay in a stall for the half for the day, put them out at night. Wow, she's just really spooked. Put them in the stall for the night and um, I'll let the boys out here. It's wet and yucky and gross out here, but at least this is a big, huge shelter that they can maybe kind of hang out in. Uh, to keep them out of the bed. Like, it's supposed to be really bad weather. So that's my goal for today. We're gonna try it, see how it goes. Oh my goodness gracious. Trap down on the floor. I don't know what for. Feels like I'm gonna lose. Silence takes a hold. I can't let it go. Chain up, no one knows. But I won't let the stormy seas Put me in open water, let me have my peace, and leave me till tomorrow. Ooh, see it's big. So it'll fit both of them. You think? 
Like they're meant that you can stretch them, but you, that's a light color. Like that's going to get stained and dirty. What were, what were we thinking? Got your girl hugging you. Yes, you do. Oh, he's like, but I want my food. Yeah, he is well mannered than Chino because he's been trained by you. Aww. Look at him. Oh. You look cute in navy, Hi. Finny Finn. Thanks. Like, what is happening? Finn has wide shoulders. Yeah, he does have wide shoulders. He's a handsome man. Some of you guys were remembering this fleece blanket that we had and thought maybe it was a cooler. It, it's not. It's a quarter sheet. This is a quarter sheet, right? Yes. And it fits differently. It doesn't. Yeah, it goes underneath your saddle, and you ride in it actually. And um, it doesn't do up. It doesn't. It's shorter. It's only a quarter sheet. But I do like to use it because it's warm to dry Gracie off. Aw, handsome. Not get to all. Okay, do it up on his belly. It is a little bit uh, big for him. Oh, Stormy, you be looking nice in orange. Wow, look at that. That was me. Yeah, they're a little big. They're, I like them. So the other good use for these fleece blankets are when your horse is wet, like Gracie. It helps to whisk the wet away from their body and warm them up fast. Anyway, Finn's looks better. It fits a little higher up on his wither. I think Gabby's just needs to be adjusted more. Love it. Me, a cooler is like putting on a bathrobe or super comfy pajamas. Everything you do with horses has to be thought about, planned out, figured out. So uh, we're gonna be cleaning the stalls with the ponies in there. To myself, away from things I let go, floating on the way. We go bottoms up, we go all the way. When you're feeling down, push the pain away. We go bottoms up. Let's let them free. Remember guys, we're just learning. So this is something new for us. Like we want to just do it always careful and yeah. slow. <laughs> so if you're like, oh, they're going to roll in the poo. No. And three, they're all free. Get hay out. Yeah, let's get hay out. Let's put it in this top part here. Finn's like, where's Stella? Where are you, girl? Yep, and that's what happens. Wow, is there a storm? Be nice. See, this is the problem with a closed in space. This is the problem with like sometimes, sometimes shelters cause problems. We've seen horses get beat up in shelters before. But yeah, they do have a chance to go outside. It's a big doorway, and there's a little bit of room for them to move away. But we're hoping that they're going to settle as soon as the hay comes out. As soon as the hay comes out, things should get fine, be fine. Storm's just trying to remind them. I'm the boss here. Storm's been the best. Gabby, your horse is a good leader. Oh, don't come this way. They're like, but there's hay. 
Just all like a bunch of piles in this section. they do a lot of running a lot of running you guys they do a lot of moving in the day like they move stormy wants to roll Get that out of your eye. Yeah, Finn's always thinking about his belly. I think they need light rain sheets on. They're taking a bite from each pile. They're doing laps. You know, a lot of people have been bringing up track, track farming. I forget what it's called, where you make like a path and where your like your paddock is kind of like a path and your horses travel long distances each day and it like really gets them going and it's really fun. Oh, I love that. It to your horse's halter and they walk around. No, this is like a paddock. So you put up all your fencing into this big long path and it winds through trees. Like, yeah, like it goes through woods, goes through trees. Oh, so it's just a Round, kind of, yeah. And then horses have to walk. You can put hay like some part in some parts so they have to go find it each day it gets them moving I, i've always been interested in that like that's exciting to me chino be one in his red bucket i think chino's color should have been red because he either loves or he either understands that the red bucket means food or he likes the color so we're going to be in the barn cleaning up now and i wanted to put that blanket on gracie she actually really likes it she it, it'll help warm her up and dry her off oh dear a new love affair on the day by day oh, farm. Uh oh. Finn was naked. Finn, choose Finn. I mean, I love Chino, but Finn is such a love. I mean, Chino's a love too, and Storm's over there. Crazy Finn's mortar side. Oh my goodness. I wanna dance with you. Everything's moving slower. I don't know what it is you do. I've been looking at you all night, trying to figure you out. I just wanna make you smile. Hold your hand in my hand, looking at the sunset. Man, you're looking good tonight. I wanna kiss you before the sun goes down. It's what you do. Wheels in motion 
moment in the in the horse barn though like it's always something exciting to see and watch that's the only girl you guys get that's it that's the only girl for you because I'm your owner Such a rainy day out that we're taking the van down to get to the barn. I have shavings in the back and I had to pick up some grain today. And we're gonna check on the boys and see what they're doing. Hopefully they're okay. They haven't come out of the barn yet. They're staying in the indoor side. We're just waiting for Slowpoke Gabby to show up. The storm is there. They're all there. They're all waiting for their gr their more hay. Yes. See, Storm said yes. Hi, Stormy. Hi, Storm. Hi. Ready for your hay? All right, we'll get you some hay. So you're good for the rain. Got make waterproof makeup. And mascara. Walking through. She looks so good. There's no one else here that I see but you. It's what you do. boys you're doing good you guys haven't been outside you're not all wet hey storm come in not all wet don't like it out there I mean. it's like I love the indoor I love the indoor arena yes I do okay so today has been a wreck of a day for so many reasons First off, I lost our vlogging camera. I lost it. I literally lost it. So the last place I had it 
was at the barn. I'm missing all day. We've looked everywhere. Did you look everywhere? We're in trouble now. Probably at the barn. If it's in the barn, I'm going to be so mad because you said you looked there. Did you look everywhere in the we barn? in the barn, but I couldn't find it. And the next reason is that I tried to work on our new intro all day. I got nothing. I have no insight, no, like I tried a bunch of different things. It's just not working. Like I'm gonna have to try another day because yeah, I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. But one interesting development in the day by day house is Gabby has progressed even further from makeup to never coming out of her room. So now that they have the lights on in here, these cool lights, they never come out of their room. My ribbons glow in the light. They're, your ribbons glow in the light? You have to turn the light off. Yeah, I will. Oh, that's so super cool. She's got her blinds closed. She's on her computer. I'm working on getting 5,000 shark teeth by the stealth boat. 5,000 shark teeth. See, now she's starting to talk like her brothers. I did not understand a single thing she just said. She's trying to buy 5,000 shark, shark teeth. It's attacking me now. Is this Roblox? Mm -hmm. Alright, so she's been laying in her bed all day eating. What did you eat before? A whole bucket Here. of raspberries. Right? Bucket of raspberries? And tomato soup. Tomato, you ate tomato soup up here? No. And now she's eating a bag of crackers. Oh, viral infection. I'm a shark. I'm a megalodon. I am yeah, this Chinese. Shark. Chinese. No, I'm... The shark, that's the biggest shark you can get. That's the second biggest shark. Okay. All right, I'm going to go pick up. I actually ended up buying something for you. What is it? So I'm going to go pick it up and I, just as soon as they call me and tell me that it's ready. It's what a is surprise. Something about puppy? Oh, gosh. If it was your puppy, I'd be freaking out. No. If it was your puppy, I'd take you with us. Anyway, it's true. People are still selling stuff on like Facebook and Marketplace and stuff. You just have to be really careful how you do it. So I email transfer money and then they put it outside their house or like we do like special stuff. But I did buy something horse related for Gabby. Do you guys see where the horses are? Yeah, we haven't seen them all day. Gracie, it's nice and warm in here. Hi, do you guys not know that you can go outside? Did we not explain it well enough for you? Oh, yeah. yeah, they know, but they don't go outside. Hi. That's what I don't understand. Like, Hi. you guys have your uh, halters? Look, he's so casual. He's all like, nobody will ever be mean to me because I'm the boss. I found the camera. I I found the camera. It was in my purse. <laughs> yeah. Was it was in happy. your purse? <laughs> yeah. Sheesh. Sheesh. I know. Hi. All right, so uh, we are here down at two for the horses in bed. It's like and kind of mild out. Oh, they need blankets on. We could probably just put. Here, Yeah, just put their. Coolers on. No, not their coolers, although that'd be nice. shopping today got some shavings got some more grain uh, that 
that's a heavy load to carry. When you're feeling down, push the pain away. We go bottoms up, we go all the way. And face that shit another day. We go bottoms up. We go bottoms up. And face that shit another day. We go bottoms up. hoping for better weather it's not supposed to rain again until next weekend and um so we should be back in normal mode tomorrow also on weekends the girls have more computer time so they spend more time in the house and less time in the barn today would have been such a good day to play with our horses they did amazing in the barn like knock on wood i don't know if we've just gotten better or if the planets are aligning and we're just having some good luck but it's been amazing having them home. They've been amazing. They've all been so well behaved. I was so worried about Chino, remember? And Storm being the leader and it's worked out so great. Like I said, I bought two things for for Gabby that I wrote that we needed, that I wanted, I've been looking for. And suddenly they just showed up in my feed today and I bought them and we're hopefully gonna go pick them up soon. We're just waiting for the lady to message us back. I'll show you that tomorrow. Gabby doesn't even know what we got her. Do you have any guesses? Two things we've been needing. Two. Sophie, go turn the water off for me. What, a girth? Go turn the water off. Uh, yes, those are things that, oh my God, we need so many things. A girth, a half pad, and a show pad. Those are Gabby's guesses. Also on Gabby's wish list are new spurs, right? Smaller spurs. And well, who do we need a girth for? Gino? Storms what, is too small. And Storms of 52? Storms is 54. Storms is Oh, so we need like a big one for like Chino. We need a probably a 56? Yeah, so Right. So we need a Chino girth. Night horses. See you in the morning. When you're feeling down, push the pain away. We go bottoms up.